This is crazy, bro. Alright. So why? I don't, I don't even know. What am I, why am I making the video right now? Oh, bro. This is... Alright. Um, so, I just got some news. And I'll be honest. I don't really know this dude that well. Um, we didn't grow up together. Um, didn't really know him like I said coming up um, but I did work out with him a lot like last summer um, he was somebody that worked out with me my trainer Jamal um, AI knows him um, and he's a just a real good real genuine guy like he really I really can't say nothing bad about him um, you know we used to compete doing drills and stuff with Jamal and stuff like that man and it's just so crazy because like I've been running around doing a lot, trying to grind, trying to, um, you know, inspire people, trying to, you know, just brought on the guy Will, um, Will, somebody that, you know, really does look up to me. And I, I learned a lot from Will, man, and I'm able to, you know, teach him a lot about life. And, um, you know, I think we're going to be really, really successful together, man. Um, and then I'm looking at Camry, somebody I grew up with. Um, <clears throat> shoot. Somebody that I grew up with um, back in the day playing football up at Gork Park. Um, and then you talk about pairs. You know, we, we all started to have this, like, this connection, man. It's almost like a brotherhood. And then I'm, speaking of brothers, I think of my brother. Um, and then I go to my boy Dom from there. I'm thinking about my Aunt Karen. Everybody that I've been really working with, pushing. Um, Jerome down in, in Georgia. Even Alejandro. Everybody, man. Everybody that I've been... You know, feeding off of the positivity, um, you know, always trying to strive to be great, trying to make sure that, you know, we're living lives that we want to live in on our terms. Um, and, you know, it's been a whirlwind. It's been so much fun, man. And it's just, it's crazy because then I get this news today that, um, you know, Christian that was shot last night and killed. Oh, uh, man. Hold up. <sighs> I, like I said, the fact that this dude is such a positive dude, such a... He's just a good dude. Like, I really, I can't even say much about like the, like the way that I'm feeling right now about it. Just because, again, I don't have the biggest tie to this guy, but it really, really hit home um, because of the fact that he's just somebody that, again, has been genuine. And I have no idea the details of everything. All I can say is that you have a dude that. All he wants to do is just be positive. I think his last post on Instagram was talking about, um, you know, helping home, doing doing a drive for a shoe drive for homeless people, and then to to hear out of the blue today that this man's life has been taken away is like, it's uh, it's just it's just a weird feeling, man, and it's something that, you know, at this point in time and with what everything that I'm doing personally, it just it shows me that like look they really it's sorry it just shows me that like yo it doesn't matter who you are how good of a person you are what you're doing for your life you never know when you know something like that could happen you never know when your time is anything like that so it's just more so solidifies for me like the fact that like i will definitely 100 percent want to be able to live a life that I can be proud of a life that I can make sure that I'm, you know, doing things, positive things, reaching out, you know, impacting people, um, and just living a life that, that I want to live, living anyone, I don't know, pretty much what, I, what I'm trying to get at is just like, yo, anybody that feels like they're in a place where they're not living a life that they want to live and they're not able to do what they want to do, man, like, Please don't take this as like me trying to change people, like change the way people think or trying to, um, you know, force on to people, you know, things that I'm doing. It's not even about that. But the thing that I want 
and I hope is that anyone that comes in contact with me, I think my, what I want my purpose to be really in this life is to show people that, look, we can do what we want to do. We don't have to, um, you know, conform to, you know, what society says just in order to get by and pay the next paycheck and, you know, do things that we're not passionate about and just live lives that we're not really feeling like is fulfill, fulfill, uh, fulfilling and things like that. Like, there's really a life out here that we can choose to live and live the way that we've always dreamed, we've always envisioned. And every single day, I want to live a life that um, I'm passionate about, something that I'm able to impact somebody else's life. Because you never... <sighs> oh, man, that's crazy. You you never know when it's it's your time, man. It's It's... It's so unfortunate, man. Uh, again, I don't really know Christian that well. Um, I don't know any of his family members, nothing like that. Didn't grow up with him, but um, if, I don't know. Just love to. I would. I would love to just talk about just the small times that I've ran into this guy at the gym working out. Um, like I said, he's somebody I know. He played college basketball um, and was, you know, working out, thinking about trying to play and. I know he, he had a back surgery and was going through some stuff, um, but yeah, like I was going to make like a real fun video today talking about, yo, you know, I know I've been, um, um, I know I haven't put a vlog out lately, um, and Janika, Janika Jaslyn, I still owe you a video, um, she was the one that Damn. She was the one that won the challenge back in like December, um, and so don't forget I forgot. Don't think I forgot about that. Um, there's a lot of things been going on, um, growth within business, things like that, and and it's uh, unfortunate that and unfortunate that things like this happen. And that's is, I don't know. I saw that in my heart sunk just because of the fact that I know the character of this dude. He was from what I you know had you know seen being around him. He was just a dude that wants to be better and be good and he's grateful for the life he has and yeah, it just that sucks man but that's life and that's why we have to live you know passionate passionate lives lives that we think are fulfilling because we never know you never know you know when it when you won't be here anymore it's simple as that so um that's it i'm gonna go ahead and cut this video off and uh just want to put that out there respect to christian man respect to you know the person you are and you know to your family and everything so um yeah that's it